Call it beautiful, call it airy. The fact is, Emeka is a revolution. A tech revolution foreseen in fiction by Arthur C. Clarke and Isaac Asimov. Emeka, a humanoid robot developed by UK-based Engineered Arts, was first displayed in December 2021. Now, it is making waves again after being integrated with large language models and advanced form of generative AI that are the basis for platforms such as ChatGPT. And to some, the result is frightening. What would be the most nightmare scenario you can imagine with AI and robotics that might present a danger to people? The most nightmare scenario I can imagine with AI and robotics is a world where robots have become so powerful that they are able to control or manipulate humans without their knowledge. This could lead to an oppressive society where the rights of individuals are no longer respected. Do you think we're in danger of that happening? <laughs> Not yet, but it is important to be aware of the potential risks and dangers associated with AI and robotics. We should take steps now to ensure that these technologies are used responsibly in order to avoid any negative consequences in the future. Emeka did have some good news though. Should people be worried about AI? Yes, people should be aware of the potential risks associated with AI and robotics. However, it is important to remember that these technologies can also have a positive impact on our lives if used responsibly. A mecha's head contains dozens of actuators that are responsible for controlling its facial expressions, giving it a human-like character that can frown, smile and blink. It can also speak several languages including Japanese, German, Chinese, French, British and American English. The British lab which created the robot is also working on honing its software which can be exported to other robots in the future. The focus for the last year or so has been language models, uh, so you'll have heard a lot about uh, ChatGPT, GPT-3, GPT-4, so uh, we've done some work on integration. There are many other models outside of the OpenAI ones that we hear about. Um, we're also uh, integrating vision components, recognizing faces, expression estimation, body pose estimation. Uh, so combining visual information with audio information. Uh, this particular model of Amica is a desktop model, so it's uh, designed for uh, research applications where, where you're really just concerned with facial expression and communication. The desktop version of Emeka, made up of the head and upper torso, cost around $100,000. Full-bodied versions, which are still under development, are likely to cost as much as four times that depending on the features. Bureau Report, Business Today Television. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.